what is going on everybody back again for another video today we're gonna be taking a look at a recent purchase from the old cambodian tire and that is this little guy here this is the gerber prybrid that's a interesting name the gerber prybrid utility I've been really interested in these little guys, like this style of EDC knife for a little while because it takes a dispensable, usable, throwawayable type of blade. And it seems like the old Cambodian tire has just recently got these because... I mean, it was the first time I saw it today, but they uh, just stocked the shelves with these as I was getting there, and it was twenty nine ninety nine, not on, not on uh, sale, which is pretty good for the old crappy tire. I was mightily impressed. I've been looking at this style of Gerber. I've seen this similar design before at um, the old Cambellas and maybe another place here locally. And I was really interested in this concept of just a, like, just a very minimal style, basically just an exact, like, a, an exacto holder. And I was a little bit disappointed because I thought for sure that this held a full length, um, Ulfa blade. I guess it would be the 18 millimeter or whatever like just a, your typical ulfa style knife um let's see here for a size comparison this is the what would this be a 25 millimeter so this is the big blade i might be getting these numbers wrong you know i don't really mess around with metric too much because it's uh verboten but anyway yeah so there you go, that's your typical large 25 millimeter Ulfa blade. And this thing goes right in the pocket. It is super sleek, has this little pry bar function. They claimed that this is does all kinds of stuff that I'm sure it actually doesn't. But overall, I'm pretty happy. It's pretty relatively easy to get the blades out. Um, let's see if I can do it here behind the camera. I think you got to push down on this. There we go. So this takes your typical, like, you work at Home Depot style of knife blade. Like, your very typical razor blade, I guess. Uh, with the two notches there. So, and it's reversible. Not my favorite. I much prefer an Ofa style blade. But can't complain really um i guess these are relatively cheap and you can also get hook blade versions so i guess that's handy ish but overall i've been you know i've let's see if i can actually get that back in there but overall i've been uh quite impressed with this i've been carrying it the last couple days and um wow that's stiff Let's try not to gank myself while I'm doing this, but yeah, I'm just going to leave it for now. Um, the action to get the blade out is a little bit gritty and it's a little bit obnoxious, but I'm sure that's going to loosen up over time. Let's take a look at the, uh, the packaging here. This is what it came with, like your typical user manual type of deal. Um, Gerber clamshell package, da, 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 a tools, that's a bit of a stretch of the imagination, exchangeable parts, aka the blade, slide lock, and bottle opener, because everybody uses, drinks, sodas. Um, full-size utility blade, so that's not accurate, G10 scales, uh is it actually g10 will the camera pick that up doesn't seem like there's lamination there but there might be so you know i'll buy the g10 scales 
slide lock, cord notch, um, wire stripper. I'm not buying the wire stripper part. This is, there's no edge to that at all. So it's not gonna make the greatest wire stripper. Small flat driver, Yep. Large flat driver. Mm. Pry bar, yes, definitely a good pry bar. Opening paint cans and stuff like that, for sure. Bottle opener. And that's all it claims to be. So it's actually mm -hmm. like maybe two or three things and it claims to be eight, but you know, we're not all perfect. What can you do? So yeah, that's the Gerber Pry Brid. I know they have a few different models of a knife real similar to this, but this is the one that they had for 30 big ones. So that's the one I got. Thanks for watching, guys.